Alright, so next leg of the journey back north, we're, uh, we've taken off from Cedar City. Salt Lake Center, American 2768340. American 2768, Salt Lake Center, Roger. We're following a route uh, that initially takes us south of Cedar City down to St. George, and then around over Zion National Park, and then up towards Grand Junction. We're going to meet, uh, meet with uh, Mike Lane up at Grand Junction if everything goes according to plan. Another look at the uh, Colob Canyon. And further over, I believe, is Zion. A little look at the route that we're planning on taking. Center, comment maintain for level 230. Flight level 230, we'll That's Zion National Park head there. Back behind us is St. George. Right down beside us is Hurricane. Got a really nice uh, runway and a housing development. American right beside 1375, the contact Las Vegas, approach 125.6. 256, contact Las Vegas, approach 125.6. Center Skywest 3133, flight level 240. Up the 1665 Valley Center, climb and maintain for level 230. I maintain for level 230, Delta 1665. Skywest 3133 Alley Center, descend and maintain for level 200. Close to the 200, Skywest 3133. Los Angeles Center, good afternoon. King Air 135 Mike, 15,000. King Air 135 Mike, Alley Center, Roger. And uh, King Air 135 Mike, uh, advice at the weather and notice at St. George and expect a visual approach. And we'll let you know when we get the weather, 135 Mike. Delta 1665, contact Alley Center, 135.55. 3555, Delta 1665. Exit uh, 7, contact Salt Lake Center, 133.6. 133.6, six at 7. To advisory, we'll uh, cancel with you on the ground, 333, it's going to 3133. Thank you. Delta 2794, contact Delhi Center, 135.55. 256, Southwest 4426. And Brace Canyon up there to the north. Southwest 3312, flight level 300, discretion 240. Southwest 3312, Delhi Center, good morning. Descend via the Tyson 5 arrival, D Las Vegas altimeter 2978. Descend via Tyson 5, Southwest 3312. Oh, that's it way up there. Spectacular, even this far away. We're now west of, uh, or east of St. George, probably 80 miles. Amazing, amazing uh, landscape around southern Utah. It just changes about every 15 minutes. Really big mountains. We're at uh, 9,500. Those guys up there look higher. Way to the south out there is the uh, rim of the Grand Canyon. I don't know if you can really get to see it this far through the haze. Called the Capitol Reef National Recreation Area, I think. And a part of Lake Powell, I think, down south there, or 
Set out one three four point five seconds. Three four five seconds. Yeah. Three change in colors of the rocks. Never ending mountain biking out here. Now we're in the uh, Glen Canyon National Recreation Area, and that looks like the Devil River right in front of the That there is where it flows into the Colorado. These are all the orange cliffs up ahead, according to the map. And over here, down that canyon, is the Colorado River. It would be unbelievable to canoe down that river. Cool stuff in Canyonlands. Keeps changing. That's the view ahead. Over here on this mesa, it looks like there's one giant rock sticking up there. I think down there is a uranium mine, according to the map, and they have... Contact Denver Center, is it 537, contact Denver Center, 135. Evaporated point, ponds back there. And straight ahead, I don't know if we can see it yet, is uh, Moab. Change course a little bit here just to get a look at the town. United 142, contact Denver Approach, 119er point three. That is Moab. Need to get back here on the ground sometime and go riding the trails. So they got it. Star four zero November contact Grand Junction Tower one one eight four one. Eighteen one four zero November. Get her back here. Oh, we're about twenty five miles from Grand Junction. Farmland around here. And a little bit of not farmland over there. Landed. Runway one one. We'll see if uh, Mike and his cousin have made it here. Military planes. 